गुड मॉर्निंग फ्रेंड्स आई होप दैट यू हैव ट्राई टू सॉल्व द प्रॉब्लम ऑन योर ओन प्रॉब्लम वन सो नाउ इन दिस वीडियो वी विल लुक एट द फर्स्ट सॉल्यूशन द फर्स्ट सॉल्यूशन मींस दैट वी विल क्रिएट थ्री थ्रेड्स वन थ्रेड विल सॉर्ट ऑल द ऑड नंबर्स सॉरी ऑल द सॉर्ट ऑल द इवन नंबर्स देन द ऑड नंबर्स एंड देन मर्ज इट विद द इवन नंबर्स एट द टॉप ऑफ द सॉर्टेड ऑड नंबर्स एंड आफ्टर दैट we will also do the follow up where we will use completable features to solve the same so let's start with the first approach so i have my intellij open and i have created the two classes in the source main i have got so sort and merge concurrently the name of the class and also have got the unit test class where we will write some unit test cases to uh, to see where uh, to assert whether our sorting is good or not so first of all because we have to sort an array let's create in this main class let's create a private field member of int array so so create this private int array and i will also create a setter method here you can also create a constructor but let's make it simple let's make a setter here so i will just set it uh, once we are trying to run this uh and let's go back to our test unit test here i will simply create the new object first Okay, sorry. So I just need to have this private final. I will just call this sort and merge currently, and just call this as sort and merge equals this. Okay. So we create it instead of setup method. We can just create it directly here. And now let's write our very first unit test case, and then we will implement it. so test method would be we have to sort and merge using threads okay using threads and a runnable interface also i will give a display name here okay and uh, then i will call sort and merge array but before that i will also need to pass the integer argument so let's use a parameterized test where we can send any number of uh, array input okay so we you will uh, we will use a parameterized test so i will use parameterized test like this and i will get it uh, all this input arrays by a method source so method source i will take it as say get input arrays i'll copy this and let's let, let's create this method here which will be giving me uh, the stream of all the integer array so for this i will control v first um and it's private static stream of arguments guys by do doing all this type of uh, using the j unit 5 features it's a good impression on the interviewer it means that he will know that you know j unit 5 very well and how to use the parameterized test with this type of uh, getting the input from the method source and here i will return stream dot off uh and inside this i will create arguments of here i will pass this new int okay the first parameter let's take it the same as what we have got here in this example of 11 elements of random so we can directly assert it here okay so this is the first and maybe i can also create some more arguments some more arrays uh, for example let's do it quickly control y and and i will just mark it as say 1 2 3 4 5 6 like this 1 2 3 okay so we have got the same input as given in the example in the problem statement 
and one with one from one to eleven, another in eleven to one. So these are all the three inputs arrays that would be passed here using the parameterized test and the method source as get input arrays which matches this. Now let's write our first unit test case where we are going to just use uh, maybe set array first. So it means that at this point we are setting the array as this as this uh, as the private field member of this. Okay, and let's call the first method. I will just use sort and merge dot. I will get the same name as sort and merge using threads. And I will change the name of this test method as uh, test. Okay. Now, this because this method is not created, now let's implement this. So, Alt Enter, create method in this. Okay. 